welcome to Ride JBI. I'm JB. In this video, I'm going to show you the best way to assemble a WP Exact Pro 6500 cartridge. The same applies for the WP Explore 6500 cartridge, and the same applies for the WP Cone Valve cartridge. So, as you can see, we got the cartridge mounted up in our vise. Do not clamp these very tight. This aluminum is pretty thin walled and it's easy to distort slash bend. We have already put oil in this and we've already bled it for quite a while to get all the air out of the system. So the next step is going to be to install our compression assembly. Before we do that, we want to set an oil height inside of the cartridge. And that oil height is going to be 135 millimeters from the top. If you have this tool, you set the length to 135, put it in, and remove the oil. I already set it for this one. An easy way to understand why we're doing that is if we look from the bottom of our cap to where our free piston seal is, that distance is 135 millimeters. So that means our oil height in here right now is right where this free piston seal is going to seal. Now, because we have a piston assembly and shims, that's also going to take up volume when this hits the oil. So we're actually going to slightly overfill the cartridge and we're going to bleed out the little excess once it's all assembled. This will ensure that there's no air pocket inside of there and we get full extension upon return of the cartridge once it's assembled. So now that we've got our oil level set, we're going to lift from the bottom and push our damping cartridge all the way up to the top. I like to use a rag in my hand so it's a little easier on my hands. Cool, so all the way up to that stops. Now we're gonna take our compression assembly and slowly work it in. As you do this, you're gonna hear air escaping out of these bleed holes. As you do that, keep pressure on this rod so it does not extend out. Awesome. Now at a certain point, you're going to feel it go solid. What that means is we're now pushing against the oil and we're trying to push this cartridge out. Now that it is solid, I'm going to let my bottom hand go, allowing the cartridge to extend. And that's also going to suck in our compression assembly into the cartridge. So now you can see we got about a half to quarter inch of threads sticking out the top. So just grab your tool, thread the assembly down, and then I will show you how to do the final bleed to get out any excess air that may be inside of there. All right, now that the compression assembly has been threaded and secured into the cartridge, we now have our full cartridge dampened assembly. So we're gonna do one last step to get out any excess oil inside of here. And the way we do that is by completely compressing the cartridge all the way down to where it stops. Take your time as you do this. So that way any air that escapes out, escapes out first and not oil. And it's gonna get progressively firmer as we get towards the bottom. And now it has fully bottomed out. I like to hold it here for about five to 10 seconds. Um, what that's doing is let out any extra air or oil so it can self-regulate its volume to the volume it wants to be. And now we can release and we see our cartridge comes all the way back out. So perfectly bled. We don't hear any oil shaking around in there, no air pockets. So this cartridge is ready to install and go ride. All JBI suspension services and parts can be found at ridejbi.com. Thank you for watching.